Hello and welcome to WordPress Tutorials. In today's video, I'll show you how to migrate products from your one WooCommerce website to another WooCommerce website. So for this, you have to have the login access to both of the stores because this will be using the default WooCommerce importer. So for example, you can see that here I have on this website approximately 160 products and I want all these products to be migrated to my another store. So this is my store, which is a WordPress store on my local host. And this is WordPress plugins on my WordPress local host, which is another WordPress installation as this store do not have any products yet. So I will migrate all these products to this store. Okay. Now we will go to the dashboard of the store where we have all 160 products listed. There we have all these products listed. We will click on this export option and scroll down. We have all export columns, all export products and all categories and click on generate CSV. Once this CSV is generated, you will have to save it on your PC. I'm saving it on my desktop with the name of sample and save. Okay, now we have the sample file on our desktop. Now let's open Google Sheets. And Google Sheets is uh, where we can organize our uh, CSV without having the Microsoft Excel or any other uh, spreadsheet application. So let's import this into the Google spreadsheet. Okay, here you can see we have variations, we have sample, simple web uh, products, we have variable products. So let's remove the first five because these are not the actual products. Okay, now let's download this as comma separated CSV file and let's call it sample again and save it. We will replace the existing file which we saved earlier. Okay. Now open the website where you want to import those products. Click on products, all products and click on create uh, start import because uh, if you do not have any products, your screen will look like this. Click on start import and the screen will appear. Grab that sample.csv file to the upload column, uh, upload file and here will be the mapping. You do not need to map anything because this is the default WooCommerce CSV and it will automatically get all these things. Okay, your products are now being imported. It will take a couple of minutes because the images are actually downloading from that WooCommerce website to your this WooCommerce website. So that will take some time. Okay, some of the products are now scrapped. If we refresh the home page, we can see that 10 products already imported to this website with all the features, with all variations, with all images and wait until it completes all the products till the end. Okay, we have um, maybe 10 more. If we refresh this, we have 20 results now. And if we open the product page, you can see images are there, all the descriptions, the related products, the prices, titles, short descriptions, everything is there. Okay, go to the importer, we have some more and it will be done. Uh, when it's done, you will see all the products are imported from the old website to the new website. So that was all for today's video. I hope you learned something. Please give this video a thumbs up and please subscribe to my channel and you will not miss my future videos. Thank you.